Hi everybody, Angel and Annalise here, and we are here for a new Owl Crate box. We've got Owl Crate Junior. Okay, so this is the August 2020 Owl Crate Junior box, and we are just gonna go ahead and dive right in and see what we have with our Owl Crate Junior box. Let's see. Let's see. Caution may contain magic. All right, so when you open up the Alcrate Junior box, it is very, very similar to the regular Alcrate box. You got your Ooh. spoiler card and all of that right there. So the theme, I'm sorry, not the spoiler card. This is the magazine that you get that tells you all of the little articles and stuff in there. So the theme for this month was Enchanted Objects and not gonna lie, I kind of bought this one because of the spoiler having very uh, Disney themed or Disney related themes on it with the apple and the lamp and the mirror and all of that. So we're just gonna go in here and find the um, spoiler information, which I believe is in here. Let's see. Ah, here's the spoiler information. Help! Harry and Ron arrive at Hogwarts in one piece by putting together this 100-piece Enchanted Ford Anglia mini puzzle featuring artwork by Mary Grand Pre from the original American book covers. <gasps> Ooh! Alright, we got squiggles. Let's get the squiggles out of the way and find our puzzle. <gasps> Look at that. Okay, so here is the Enchanted Car Puzzle. And this is their last licensed Harry Potter item this year. We're not sure if they're going to bring it back, but they did say that this was going to be the last licensed Harry Potter item. Um, so taking the plastic off so you guys can see that just a little bit better. So that is the Enchanted Car. Um, it's a 100-piece puzzle. So there's, there's a puzzle. Well, not right now. We're going to build it later. So Harry Potter puzzle. Yay. Yay. All right. Next, never judge things by their appearance, even carpet bags. This Mary Poppins inspired clasped clout pouch was designed by Rebecca Mills. We think it's practically perfect in every way. So let's see if we can find in our squiggles. Oh, the pouch. Oh, you guys. It's so cute. It's the little handle from Mary Poppins. Um, was it her umbrella? I yep. believe it was her umbrella. And it's a little money pouch. So there you go. I haven't seen a clasping one like this in a long, long time. So there you go. We're ignoring it. Stop. All right. Use your floating Percy Jackson inspired riptide pen for writing emergencies only. Emergencies include jotting down brilliant ideas and secret notes. All right. We have a pen amongst the squiggles. Let's see if we can find the pen. I believe I found the pen. Pen. Alright, so, ooh, ooh, I like it. It moves, so you can see the lightning bolts on this side, and it moves up and down the pen, and then oh, on this side you have the sword. I'm trying to get focused. There we go, focusing. So there's the sword on that side. That's cute. Riptide right there. And it twists. We like that. We love pens. Okay. Next, award-winning author Mary Hillary McKay, who also wrote our wonderful June book, The Theme of Green Magic, uh, The Time of Green Magic, sorry, reimagines classic fairy tales with her own special twist in Straw into Gold Fairy Tales Respun, a beautifully illustrated collection of short stories. Uh, 
is that this one, this, this one. So straw into gold. So there you go. Straw into gold. That reminds me of Rapunzel. No, not Rapunzel. Um, Rumpelstiltskin. So let's see. Yep, straw into gold, gold or Rumpelstiltskin. The tower and the bird or Rapunzel. Ooh. Yeah, it's a bunch of little short stories. So this will be good. It even has a few pictures. See? Wow. A few little pictures in there. So there we go. So there's that. We like books, obviously. We get all great. All right. And three sisters trapped by an ancient curse. Three magical objects with the power to change their fate. Will they be enough for the Wildershin sisters to break the curse? Or will they lead the sisters even deeper into danger? A Pinch of Magic is the first in an enchanting new series from Michelle Harrison. Your Alcrate Jr. exclusive signed edition comes with a letter from the author written just for our subscribers. So that is the book. So here we go. Ooh, we have a sticker. So cute. It is. Oh, there you go. I can put this in my door. You can put it on your door. So here's the book. A Pinch of Magic. That'll be a fun little book to read, won't it? Ooh. Yeah. There you go. And as always, it is signed by the author. So there you go. So that's the cover of the book. So this is the Alcrate Exclusive Edition. And in this, it shows us what the original cover looked like. So let me see. So the original cover was more blue, while the Alcrate Junior cover is purple. So there you go. All right. And the last thing in the box is the spoiler card for the next month, I believe. Um, here's the letter from the author. And September's spoiler card is here. And it says, the theme of the September Alcrate Jr. is shivers down your spine. And we are going to be getting this book this month, or the, in September. Um, it says, readers beware, you're in for a scare. September's book is a stunning own voices ghost story that will have you turning the pages late into the night. This story will be perfect for fans of the Jumbies, Doll Bones, and ghost stories from around the world. P.S. If you're already a subscriber, your account will renew automatically. Yay! So that is September's theme, Shivers Down Your Spine, and we are looking forward to that. We do love our September boxes. They always seem to have really good um, themed items in them. So that is it for our Alcrate Junior unboxing. This is the first unboxing that we did with Alcrate Junior, and I do think that we love all of the items in this box just as much as we do the regular box. So... We may or may not keep going with it, but we are definitely getting September, so stay tuned for that video. All right? Ready? Ready. All right. We will see you guys next time. Thanks for watching. Bye. Bye.